Hi everybody, it's Liz Kiefer and it's Teach Me Tuesday. I am very excited. So each Teach Me Tuesday tweet is actually going to be two tweets. One will be a video like this one with some explanation and an example, but there'll also be another tweet attached, which will just be the explanation written out and then an example in a picture so everyone can learn in the way that is best for them. I thought it would be nice to start out with sort of some building blocks, so we're going to try some stanza variations in the next couple of weeks, instead of jumping right into a form that has both a rhythm and a rhyme. A tercet is a three-line stanza, so what we're going to try today is called tersa rima. So these are three-line stanzas. The first and the third line rhyme with each other. The second line provides a rhyme that goes on in the next tercet. So it goes A, B, A, B, C, B, and you can end it with a fourth line like this, C, D, C, D, or you can end it with a couplet, C, C. And this can be any length that you want. It can go on and on, or it can be very short. Again, the rhythm is not important. It's only the rhyme scheme that we're trying to do. And so here is a little example of this. My tentative eyes venture oceans, journeying horizons vast, finding you in the waves' motions. Each charm is so baited and cast to entice you to bite on my line, hope for a dish that will last. Savor salt taste of kisses divine, rock my sultry seas, rhythm of ease. Sail on as the gulls cry you mine, a journey so certain to please. So as you can see, I ended with the quatrain. So I hope everybody will try it out and have a great time. Don't leave me hanging.